Hey! I found breadsticks! I love breadsticks! Holy mother of monkeys! These breadsticks are stale! I'm going to climb breadsticks. These breadsticks are way beyond eaten. I bet we can find another way to put them to good use. Yeah, I know, I know. Let me do it. These breadsticks are no. way beyond eaten. I bet we can find another way to put them to good use. Ladder. The steps are missing. No way I can climb it the way it is, man. Oh, I had to drag it. This might be dumb enough to work. Man, they fit perfectly. Let's hope they don't snap when we climb them. After you, lady. <laughs> After you. Man, I haven't been here since I was a little kid. It's just the way I remember it. The only thing missing is that fool of a father of mine, Crown and Dodo. Missing? Where'd he go? We've no idea. He just disappeared one day when we were kids, and we ain't heard from him ever since. But we've done just fine without him here. Aside from some slight financial instability, we've done fine. You find what you're looking for, lady? I want to get out of here. This place gives me the creeps. Oh, sorry. No, I can't seem to find the book I'm looking for. Could you help me find it, perhaps? It's supposed to be leather-bound and have a big swirly symbol on its front. Sure, no problem. I bet it's in this mess somewhere. It's a bunch of books on plants, trees, and herbs. No swirly sign books here. Sorry. Books. No, it's not in this pile. Only old children's books there. I remember lying in this bed having stories read to us. We had some good times before he dumped us here on our own. That's for sure. I don't remember the bed being so darn stiff though. Wait a minute. There's something... Hey, lady! I think I might have found your book. You found it? Amazing! What's so special about this old thing? It's the journal of the journey down. The what? It's a collection of scribbles and notes on how to reach the Underland. The Underland? Isn't that sort of illegal? Yes, so much as touching the Underland literature is illegal. I spend all my time looking for it. Uh, okay. You spend all your time looking for illegal literature? What for? Aren't you afraid of getting caught? Oh, they haven't caught me so far. Well, who's after you? You know of the Armando Company, I take it? Sure, everybody knows of them. We recently became customers. You together with the rest of St. Armando, I have reason to believe there's something fishy going on in the city. And someone is covering it all up. And somehow, I'm certain this book is the key to understanding the whole puzzle. I need to call the university immediately to confirm this find. Here you go, lady. I'm sorry, it doesn't seem to be working. Oh, man! I bet the switchboard reset itself when we lost the power. Give me a second. I'll have it fixed. Yeah, looks like we're gonna need to re-enter the phone number of this place. It would have been a piece of cake if it weren't for the fact that I forgot it. Oh, it was on a card. Folders. It's a bunch of folders we made to lively up our business. Never mind the suspiciously low price. Cow Nandodo's gas and charter covers all of your fuel and transport needs. No questions asked. Call 99450 and we'll make an offer you okay. may not refuse. Hey, that's the number right there. 99450. I knew painting these folders would pay off. I can't move it.
I don't know if I'm doing this right. I can't move it. How the hell am I supposed to move it? I can't move it. Or is it supposed to be the other way? I can't move it. What? Ah, that's it! Hello, Professor. This is Lena. Calm down, calm down. What's happened? Good God, did they steal anything? No, that's all right now that we have the book. Don't worry, I know just the place to hide. This plane of yours, does it fly? That pile of rust down there hasn't been flown for 20 years! Then you better get her in order fast, Buana. I'm a customer, remember? You know, the kind of person who has way too much money for their own good. Get my drift? When you put it that way, Buana Air is at your service. Let's go run this by my mechanic, okay? Here she is. A precious airplane. Come on in and check out the insides. What do you think, lady? A beauty, isn't she? Yes, yes. It's very uh, charming. But can you get her airborne? Airborne? Are you crazy, lady? This plane hasn't flown for decades. One moment, please. You got to help me out here. We need this money so bad, and you know it. One flight and our debt to the power company will be long gone. You think you can get her running? I have no idea. Do you still think you can fly her? Hey, there's only one way to find out, right? <laughs> I guess you're right, Buana. Let's give it a shot. That's the spirit. Of course we can get her airborne. Great. That's what I wanted to hear. Just give us a couple minutes to do some tiny touch-ups and then we'll be on our way. A couple of minutes? Tiny touch-ups? Yeah, what's the big deal, man? What are we missing? Well, for starters, we have no engines. Oh. And we're missing a propeller, too. Also, we're gonna need something to steer with. No worries, man. You get started while I go find the missing junk, okay? Okay, man. Good luck part hunting. A pair of engines, a propeller, and something to steer with. Shouldn't be too hard to come by. Yeah. Nice fan. fan! Hmm, if only I could get it down somehow so I could use it as a propeller. Oh, I'd love a nap. But I'm not quite sure Lena would approve right now. Okay, so how am I supposed to... Use the sheets? You never know when a slice of cheese will come in handy. I can't reach it with that. Okay. Yeah. Mm. That's my pilot certificate. Kao Nanduru gave it to me a couple days before he disappeared. Me and Kito got this huge muddy ugly once when we were kids. Boy, we were proud. Kito loves rubbing his picture in my face because of the silly haircut I had back then. I tried teasing him that he's gotten fat since this was taken, but it doesn't work. He just sees it as an improvement. That's Kito, my mechanic and very best friend. We grew up here together. That is one big juicy muddy ugly. I haven't heard muddy of anybody ugly. pulling up a bigger one than this. Besides Matoki, of course. But that doesn't really count. He spends all his time fishing. It's a patron of our father, Captain Kao Nandodo. He Kao adopted Nando. me and Kito off the streets when we were scumbag kids. We miss you, man. Where did you go?
nice candles. We used to have them lit all the time back in the day when Cow Nan Dodo was around. Okay, I can't see anything there. Um... 